Dutch royal reporter Rick Evers has announced he will auction his copy of Omid Scobie's Endgame in honor of the translators at the center of the alleged royal racist scandal. In a post shared on X, formerly Twitter, Mr. Evers, who is a royal family expert, wrote, I have decided to have my copy of Final Battle, Endgame, auctioned for charity. Proceeds from this book, which starred on TV in the UK, US, Australia and Canada, will benefit at Auteurs Bond, in honor of the two translators who unwittingly found themselves in the middle of a media storm. The controversy began in March 2021 when Prince Harry and Meghan Markle first made claims to Oprah Winfrey that a member of the royal family had made comments about how dark Prince Archie's skin might be before his birth in May 2019. Last week those names were published in error in the Dutch version of Endgame, while Mr. Scobie, 42, has insisted he was unable to publish them in the UK due to legal reasons. Click here to join our WhatsApp community to be the first to receive news about the royal family The author, who has been labelled Meghan's mouthpiece in some circles, denied any knowledge of the error, putting it down to a publishing mistake. However, the translators in the Netherlands hit back, saying the names were in the manuscript they had been sent and they had simply translated what was in front of them. The Daily Express has chosen not to reveal the names of the royal family members at the center of the alleged royal racism scandal, after Piers Morgan announced them on his talk TV show. The firm is believed to be considering taking legal action after certain names were published in error in the Dutch translated version of Endgame. Translator Saskia Peters told the Mail Online, As a translator, I translate what is in front of me. The names of the royals were there in black and white. I did not add them. I just did what I was paid to do and that was translate the book from English into Dutch. Become an Express Premium member support fearless journalism read the Daily Express online. Advert free get super fast page loading start 30 day free trial Mr. Scobie told ITVs this morning that the names were not there when he submitted the book to his publisher, saying, I never submitted a book that had those names in it. However, a source later told The Times that United Talent Agency had earlier sent a draft version to publisher Zander Ujever in the Netherlands. It is understood that an earlier draft of the book, which contained the names, was translated, rather than the final proof, but all copies have now been pulled from sale. Sources close to Harry and Meghan have also encouraged them to denounce Endgame and distance themselves from Omid Scobie, or risk it ruining their careers. One told The Express, there are potential deals on the table for Meghan that could just as quickly vanish if this continues. Aside from the race row, even the American public is growing weary of mean-spirited and downright cruel attacks on the Princess Kate. Whether or not Meghan and Harry were the sources of these, people will simply assume they were because of their past connections with Mr. Scobie. Unless they immediately distance themselves from him and denounce his book as either untrue or reported out of context, then they must expect to be a part of the backlash against it.